Today, I'm going to show you how you can test your reaction time using everyday objects at home. I've asked my friend Charlotte to join me to help demonstrate. Hi, Charlotte. Hi, Zoe. Are you okay if we test your reaction time? Sure. Okay, try to catch this dollar bill in between your fingers when I drop it. If you do, you can keep it. Okay. Can I try again? Sure. So close. This happens because our reaction to what we see is not instant. Let's try it with something a bit bigger, like a ruler. I got this. Yes! When the ruler or dollar bill is dropped, your eyes see it, but it takes time for the nervous system to send that information to your brain. Then your brain needs to process it and decide what to do. In this case, grab it. Then a signal is sent to your hand and the muscles contract, allowing you to catch the object. The time it takes to do all of that is called reaction time. That was 17 centimeters. You can measure the distance the ruler falls before you grab it and convert it to reaction time by using the table like this. Write down your results and compare it with your friends. See who has the fastest reaction times. In this case, our reaction times are about the same. But to make it a real experiment, you need to collect a lot more data. Thanks for coming, Charlotte. You got it, Zoe. Try it yourself.